So we just had pizza, which is good, obviously. I don't think you can really get bad pizza here. And then now we're on our way to Bite Beauty, which is a brand which I really like anyway. I use their stuff anyway, but they have a lip lab here and it's where you can go and like make your own lipstick. So fingers crossed they've got space for me today. What a surprise. <laughs> making my own lipstick and we're gonna do we're gonna do a nude so we've written down my name the kind of color the undertone is it the undertone to yeah, yeah. yeah the color family that we're looking for um and then we've written down we're gonna go for one that's nice and light and then one that's um a little bit deeper so i'm very excited kate's helping me kate's helping me create my own lipstick oh that looks like it that looks like the one it's so cool. So basically you pick your finish and we're going for matte which is not it's not dry at all. It's like super super kind of creamy but long lasting and then we pick our colours. Once I've got a colour that I like, I think I'm right in saying that we pick a flavour. Yes. Decided on a winner and it's this one right here. It is so nice. I will show you later when I'm getting ready. And then now we're gonna try a kind of slightly deeper nude. Okay, what's the most popular colour that you think that you make? So nudes and reds are popular. Nudes and reds. I can see that. I can see that happening. So cool. So I just tried this one on, it's a wee bit too warm, so we've made it a little bit cooler colour and I'm gonna try that one on now. Or something like super natural for a uh, daytime. So this is the one we just tried on for fun obviously but six shades of beautiful nudes and you know what they were all so so nice but the ones that were my favourite were this one right here which is super brownie. What would you call this if you had to describe it? Kind of taupey nude. A light taupey nude, and then this one here, which is a bit. Is it this one? Yeah. Yeah, that's one. This one here, which is a wee bit deeper, but um, oh, they're both just so nice. I'm gonna wear. I think I'm gonna wear this one tonight. Cool. So these are the smells that you can pick to have in your lipstick. You can either have just one by itself, or you can mix a couple together. Nice. I, I think they're all nice. I've already had a wee sniff of them, if I'm honest, and I like the blueberry. What the guys do is they write down the formula and then that's how you make it. So, you won't be able to buy this online if I'm ever wearing it and you guys are like, wow, what a beautiful lipstick. But if I give you my secret formula, you can come to uh, Bite Lip Lab and you can actually give them the formula and they will make it for you. And it's gonna be called Jamie. And the little tubes you get are exclusive just to the lip lab. So they have these really cute little kiss marks all over them. <gasps> I'm so excited. So this is the lipstick's pre-melted. And then what do we do now? So we're gonna melt them. <laughs> we're gonna melt them in the microwave. No way. So we put them in the microwave. It's got all the components. It's got the the taste, the smell, the matte, and then the the pigment as well. And then am I right in thinking that Bites lipsticks are all food grade nearly? You can eat them. Okay, right. I'm gonna do this. Can I do it here? Can I do this to test? Don't judge. Right. You guys know that I've tasted a few eyeshadows in my time. Kind of sweet. They're all getting made and finished and I'm getting to take away my card that's got my formula on it as well. 
the secret recipe. And it's just like a cooling plate. Yeah, it's negative 13 degrees Celsius. Okay, I was just saying that if you know anyone that's coming to New York, they actually sell gift cards. So I actually said, I was like, this would be such a nice gift to give somebody to come and make their own lipstick. Baby. <laughs>